I'm Henry Moore III, and this is How to Mogul. Today, I'm going to show you how to use the new iMessages in the iOS 10 update. Um, basically, to get the features when you're using a 6 and below, since they don't have the force touch, when you type out your message, I'm just going to type anything, thank you, and you see this little up arrow, you click and hold, and then you have the options to do the different effects for your text or instead of doing that you can go ahead and click on screen and you get the different screen effects when you send text and you just hit that up arrow and they get it pretty sure my sister is going to get a kick out of that <laughs> all right now another effect that you can do is actually doing different kind of scribes kind of like really exactly like what people do on a watch so you can pick your colors, obviously by hitting the color, and then exactly how you draw it, that's how they get it. So I can draw out I, and when I send that, it actually scribes it to them. And then if you tap over to the right, as you can see, it has these different gestures you can do. You see the one tap, that gives you like a fireball. Two taps give you a kiss. If you tap two fingers twice, it gives you the heart. And then if you do the two fingers and drag down, it gives you a broken heart. So you get all these different options. When you click to the right, it tells you exactly what it is, kind of kind of bigger. And every time you do something, they get it. So if you're trying to like, I didn't mean to see my friend a kiss, well, they're going to get it because just like I just did that, there's no send button or anything. It just happened. So I can click, hold, and oh, did a fireball because I just read it as bam. They read it as one finger instead of the two fingers, did the broken heart, and there's no send button. So just be aware of that. If you randomly text into somebody, and if you don't do this, exactly what you do with the gestures, they get it, and you can't take it back. <laughs> so, and also for messages, you also have its own kind of app store. So you can do, you know, find different gifts to send people. You can, they got sticker packs. And I'm pretty sure that's going to be big. They already started charging people for that. Got to make money. And you also go share music and go through your recents also and send that as well in the message. And I'm not sure if you, I'm going to show you a little nifty trick to kind of get rid of some messages that you don't want to have in your messages. If you click and hold, you have an option to click on more and you can actually delete like a few of these at a time. Just hit the delete messages and now they're gone. Now also when you click and hold, you have options to add kind of like emotions or like kind of tags to a certain message. So I click and hold, obviously if you got the 3D touch, it'd be more just of a press instead of a hold, but click ha ha, it goes right on, tags it right onto the message. Also just while playing around, I, I came across another feature um, right under picking the colors for the messages, you can actually doodle on your videos. So this is me and I'm gonna pick me a color and I'm gonna draw on this and I could actually send this out if I wanted to. So let's go ahead and record this. Yeah. I'm pretty sure my sister's getting a trip out of this. Add some of that, some of that. All right, so I did all that and I'm going to send it. And as you can see, all the stuff that I did actually is going out to her. And you also could do this with just a standalone picture too, but it's kind of cool that you can do that with the video. Awesome. Don't forget to hit the like button and <laughs> subscribe to the channel. Peace.